Oh yeah, all right. That's right, it's Joe here for Joyrider TV on the FX1 and we're going for seven minutes of fury. And oh my goodness, this one, I'm finding a little bit intimidating already. Um, it's pretty windy. I'm guessing about 18 to 20 knots. Um, and the aim of the game is using telemetry overlay to see how much distance I can cover in seven minutes. So a lot of single-handed uh, kite flying here. Just trying to keep these bows out of the water. Got the main sheeted in rather tight. We got the ferry coming out as well, just for an extra bit of spice. Yeah, if the ferry wasn't there, I'd certainly feel a bit more comfortable. He could do with putting his foot down a bit. We've done 19 knots already. All right, if uh, we get too close to the ferry, we might have to abort this run. Stay tuned, see what on earth is going to happen on this seven minutes of absolute fury charging down towards the island of Ithaca. Okay, so it, don't tell anyone we're doing this, but it does look fairly feasible to cross in front of the ferry here. Certainly wouldn't recommend this sort of behavior, uh, but I don't think anybody's gonna find out. Just taking the juice off a little bit, just to make sure that nothing too sketchy happens just here. All right, so keeping the juice low. We've done four minutes already. All right, just hanging out the back, sheet in the kite, trying to keep the bows out, and off we go. All right, I think we've almost crossed the ferry now. Uh, that was about as close as I'd ever want to be to that bad boy. All right, so the kite flying that's going on here, I'm just keeping the kite as loose as possible, making sure that at no time is it ever oversheated okay but uh, as we come oh a bit of a hole there so looking for the next gust coming down because that next gust is going to require quite a bear away yeah so we've actually sailed out of the wind here which is a very interesting vasiliki phenomena all right but uh we just like that wind to come back on, we can see it. It's gonna be a big bear away when it comes. Here we go. And there was about 45 degree bear away there uh, as the wind comes back on. And we're back underway. We've just under about three minutes to go. Woo! All right, crikey. Yeah, this wind is so patchy down here. Uh, this is one of those things in Vasiliki Bay. Whoa, big gust, massive bear away. Okay, we're back on. All right, because once we're going at speed, we're all right. But if we lose the speed and then we get a big gust, what happens is the rig loads up with pressure. And then when we get the big gust, we're likely to send the bows downhill get loaded up with pressure and uh, who knows what might happen next. All right, just coming up to two minutes to go. Bit of a gust there, bearing away. A bit more of a gust, bearing away a bit more. Really hanging off the back of the boat. Whew, crikey, back leg is burning, I can tell you. And uh, crikey, I'm actually quite looking forward to when I can drop this and start the upwind leg for the return back to the sailing area. This is one of the sketchiest things I've done this week. But, all right. Whew. Oh, God, 
like so patchy down here that I'm not quite able to sheet in enough. But uh, and then we want to be ready for the next big gust. Top speed about 19 and a half so far. About a minute and a half to go. Oh, I don't think we're going to be breaking any records on this seven minutes of fury. But stay tuned as the next gust comes down and we'll see what is cooking in the kitchen as we get further downhill here. All right, under a minute to go now. There we go. That's the wind that we want. Enough wind to get that hull lifted and just get a cruising, but this chop is getting a bit choppy. Oh. There we go. Bit of constant wind as we get further away from the thermal effect. Woo. Yeah, so the telemetry you can see on screen supplied by telemetry overlay, which having done a lot of research, I can tell you is the best and uh, you should get it. It's very good. You do have to pay for it, but you definitely get what you pay for. Okay, we're just coming up to the finish line now. Now I started my watch a little bit early, so I'd say we're probably at 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and there we go. Oh my word, stay tuned for some more. Thank you very much. <laughs> 